Smooth Transitions, The Bridge Between Ideas. Hello everyone. In today's video, we'll delve deep into the world of essay writing for SAT and ACT, specifically focusing on transitioning between ideas. Transition words and phrases play a pivotal role in ensuring that your essay flows smoothly, and today, we'll explore how to use these effectively. Let's jump right in. Whenever we write, especially for a timed test, we want our readers to easily follow our thoughts. Transitional words and phrases act like bridges, connecting one idea to the next. Without them, our writing can seem choppy or disjointed. By effectively using these transitions, we not only enhance the flow but also strengthen the logic and coherence of our essays. Now, let's take a look at some commonly used transitional words and phrases. 1. Addition. Moreover, furthermore, in addition, also. 2. Example. I love reading books. Moreover, I have a vast collection at home. 3. Contrast. However, on the other hand, conversely, nonetheless. 4. Example. The weather was cold. However, they decided to go for a walk. 5. Cause and effect. Because, therefore, consequently, as a result. 6. Example. He didn't study for the test. As a result, he scored poorly. 7. Sequence. First, second, next, finally. 8. Example. First, she went shopping. Next, she visited her grandmother. Remember, the key is to select the most appropriate transitional word or phrase for the context. Don't just throw them in randomly. 1. Variety is the spice. Avoid using the same transitional words repeatedly. Mix them up to keep the reader engaged. 2. Stay relevant. Ensure that the transitional word or phrase you choose is relevant to the point you're making. 3. Don't overdo it. While transitions are essential, using too many can make your essay sound forced or artificial. Strike a balance. That wraps up our discussion on transitional words and phrases. Remember, these transitions are like the glue holding your essay together. Use them judiciously, and you'll see a marked improvement in the flow and coherence of your essays. I hope you found this video useful. Until next time, keep writing and refining your skills.